Welcome to Ag Week TV, I'm Michelle Rook. The COVID-19 pandemic has disrupted business as usual, including international travel, and that has halted export trade missions for the ag community. Soybean farmers export more than half their products, so market development is the most critical for this sector. That's forced them to get creative to connect with customers. During the COVID-19 pandemic, the U.S. soybean industry has had to take a different approach to international market development. For years, trade missions have focused on in-person meetings between buyers and U.S. soybean farmers. But with the pandemic, they're relying on technology. So it's learning how to do business different. So having to do more virtual meetings, uh, and Zoom meetings to meet with people. This allows their trade group, the U.S. Soybean Export Council, to build relationships. But they're anxious to return to hosting customers on farms and visiting international companies. But it's not quite like being face to face with a customer and, and particularly in Asia where the people like to have a relationship with the people that grow the crop. Those international people come to the U.S. to visit farms and I've had the opportunity to, to have them on my farm and to visit with many of them as they come to visit. Asia is just one of the many areas they're targeting, especially since the China trade war. And we realize we need to have markets in every country that wants U.S. soybeans. And that's critical for soybean farmers who export over half their crop. 